Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red van. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure they'll be knocking ring letters through your door. <laughs> postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat, and his black and white cat. Singing, the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. This too, our PC Selby. What a funny shape. <gasps> Looks like a big lollipop. <laughs> so it does. Come on, Jess. Meow. Bye, Mrs. Goggins. Bye, Pat. Oh. There's PC Selby. Morning, Arthur. I've got a parcel for you. Marvelous. I've been waiting for this. Um. Aren't you going to open it? Well, it's just I'm planning a little surprise for Dr. Gilbertson. I don't want to say too much just yet. Oh, well, I look forward to seeing it. You'll be sure to hear about it. Dr. Gilbertson loves the banjo. Here's a tune she like. It's Dr. Gilbertson. Can't let her see me before I'm ready. Better find somewhere quieter to practice. Morning, Dorothy. Here's your post. Ooh. I say, those strawberries look good. Oh, thanks, Pat. Do you want one? Ooh, yes, please. I've picked lots of them for Nisha to make strawberry tarts. Could you take them down to the cafe for me? Right. I'm just over here. <gasps> oh. Oh. They've gone. I wonder what's happened to them. <sighs> well, it's a mystery, all right. I know. I'll go and get PC Selby. He's good at solving mysteries. <laughs> Uh, that's it. Uh, no, wait a minute. No, a G. Oh. Here! Where are you going? Come back! Right, I just put my new opening hours up on the village notice board. Gotcha. Now then, where was I? Oh, someone's playing the banjo. How lovely. Oh, no! That's Dr. Gilbertson's car. Mustn't let her catch me before I'm ready. Hello, Arthur. Oh, sorry, Pat. Can't stop. Uh, but, um... Oh, hello, Pat. I didn't know you could play. Um, I'm sorry. I thought I heard someone playing the banjo. Wasn't it you? No. Oh, how strange. Ah, oh, well... Got to drop these healthy eating posters off at the school. Bye, Pat. Bye, Dr. Gilbertson. We've got to yeah. catch up with B.C. Selby. Dorothy will be wondering where we've got to. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you lot. Um, could you keep an eye on Miss Strawberries? 
I'm just going to pop down the lane and see if Pat's back yet. Can we have some, Mum? Of course you can, love. Thanks, Mrs Thompson. Just one or two, mind. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what can be keeping him? Uh, where are the strawberries? Oh, no, Bill. I said you could have one or two, not all of them. It wasn't us, Mum. Honest. Maybe they've been taken by a, an intergalactic invisible alien who needs strawberries to fuel his spaceship. You what? Lacking Captain Zap and the alien Starfleet. Don't be daft. Don't worry, Mum. We'll help you pick some more, won't we? Yeah! yeah. It's that lovely tune again. Hello? <gasps> Dr. Gilbertson? Oh, not again. Hello? Anybody there? Quick. Out the back way. Oh, that's funny. There's no one here. There's his car. Yeah. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> Arthur! Wait! Oh, Pat, hello again. Did you just hear music? Sorry, Dr Gilbertson. Can't stop. This is all very mysterious, I must say. Finished! Well done, children. Where on earth can Pat and PC Selby be? Maybe the intergalactic aliens taken them for a trip on his spaceship. Or maybe... There's a strawberry thief about. If there is, then PC Selby will catch him. Ah, <sighs> oh, perfect. No one about for miles. Now, where was I? At last. Come on, Jess. Where is he? And where's that music coming from? Oh, hello, Pat. I was just, uh, I was inspecting the platform. Official duty, like. I didn't know you could play the banjo, Arthur. Um, what banjo? Meow. Oh, you mean this banjo? Uh, it's meant to be a surprise for Dr Gilbertson. I've been trying to practice. Well, I'm sorry to interrupt, but there's a bit of a mystery at Thompson Ground. A mystery? Why didn't you say? Solving mysteries is what an officer of the law does best. Pat, there you are. Oh, thank goodness you were here, Arthur. It's the strawberries. They've been stolen. First things first, Meow. we need to look for clues. Meow. Look over here. There's a claw print. I told you, it's the alien's claw print. <gasps> alien, eh? I wonder. Who's got claws around here? Meow. 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 <laughs> I don't think it's Jess, Arthur. Maybe we'd better make a list of suspects. Just listen to those birds. They've been singing all day. Jess! Come back! Stop, Jess! Oh, no! 
Looks like we've caught our thief after all. Not sure that I've got any paw cuffs. But it can't be Jess. Jess, where are you going? He's escaping. <coughs> Here, what's that bird got in its beak? And that one, look. Strawberry stalks. I owe you an apology, Jess. Here are your thieves, Dorothy. What? The birds? <coughs> I told you it wasn't aliens. Oh, well done, Arthur. But how will I keep them away long enough to get strawberries, Venetia? I wonder if some banjo playing would keep them away. <laughs> Your banjo playing is lovely, Arthur. When are you going to play for Dr Gilbertson? Uh, well, I'm not sure. Well, why don't we invite her to a strawberry tea party? You can do your surprise here. That's a good idea. It's a shame the birds can't have any more strawberries, though. Maybe we ought to help them. Hello, Nisha. Here are the strawberries for your tarts. Oh, thank you, Pat. I was wondering what had happened to them. Um, uh, Nisha? Yes? PC Selby is planning a surprise tea party for Dr Gilbertson up at Thompson Ground. We couldn't have one of your strawberry tarts, could we? Of course you can, Pat. I'll bring one up as soon as I finish baking them. That'd be grand. Now, I've just got to find Dr Gilbertson and invite her. I hope this works. Oh, hello, Pat. I was just going to put my feet up and have a nice cup of tea after my rounds. Why don't you come up to Thompson Ground instead, Sylvia? Dorothy's making strawberries and cream. Oh, that sounds lovely. They're coming. Oh, dear. You'll be fine, Arthur. Hello, everyone. Oh, Meow. it's that tune again. My favourite tune on my favourite instrument. Oh, Arthur. Meow. What a lovely surprise. <laughs> oh. And thank you for finding the strawberry thieves as well. Oh, well, it was... it was nothing. But how are you going to keep them out of the strawberry patch once P.C. Selby has gone? <laughs> That's easy. We've made them their own bird table. That way, they won't need to go in the strawberry patch. Oh, this is a lovely tea party. Thanks, Pat. You're welcome, Arthur. Now... Let's hear that song again. Yeah! Yes, the cat. 